uh, and if you have at least like one friend it's uh that increases it i think it's definitely preferred to be played with like one other person at least because there are some times where like you run into enemies that um it can get pretty difficult i wish the only thing that i think like as far as leveling and stuff would make it better is if there was an auto level system or like scaling so like if there was a level 50 enemy nearby you then it would you would be scaled up or like scaled down or whatever um because it gets pretty rough at times by yourself and that's the one thing where like a companion would come in and be really really helpful if uh you had one but if you have one friend that makes up for it um it can get a little frustrating here and there but the storyline has been pretty fun so far i uh, i'm trying to think what else there's a lot of stuff to do there's a lot of people to talk to now so thanks i've been recommending it if somebody sees a sale for like this game for 15 20 dollars it i would say at that value it's worth it she'll be ready once i finish or if somebody has the game already that too i say that it's it's worth checking out all right i'll see you in the foundation there presently just need to grab a thing or two so don't worry about checking back in right away i'm sure nice there's, she's all set up then. See, is that the end? Return the page, nice. Oh, sweet, it's free to fast travel the foundation. Um, in a second here, you'll see one of those settlements for uh, all the, the NPCs and stuff. I I really wish, I I think that 100% the game should have launched like this. I still had a lot of fun playing with friends back in the day, um, like when it originally released, but for the value, I mean, I got a, uh, not a free key, but like a cheap one. So uh, that's why I jumped in at the beginning, but definitely with this content and the the story so far it's 100 percent should have launched like this um but it's good so far i think i'm gonna stick through until i i actually finish the story and stuff my playthrough i'm gonna side with the uh the settlement the settlers instead of the raiders. All right, so here we are. This is the uh the foundation which is the uh the non raiders settlement. It's a guard right there. Maybe Ward has more drawing paper I can Hope we can set up more settlements like Foundation. Sunny, provide me All right, so we need to go talk to Paige again. Ah, the good old level one, day one, alt tech picture. Region, uh, okay, I was about to read that, but never mind. Foundation and those raiders have a crater. To All right, here's you Paige. You secured our way down to the vault pretty handily, haven't you? Yep, yep. I just can't believe your luck in finding Dr. Horn right. It's nothing. I just uh, just did what I needed to be done, Tell or what needed to be done. Even more impressive. All right, I've been working on the next problem we need to solve for busting into Vault 79. That doozy of a laser grid. I figure we got some experienced scavengers in Foundation already. Folks who know a thing or two about busting bunkers. Small ones, anyway. Thing is, before I even start asking around, our youngest scavenger pops up to tell me she's got it handled. Handled? Before I even told her the problem. Uh-oh. Uh... 
Honestly, maybe she's tougher than she seems. She's been with us for a while, so I can vouch for her loyalty at least. She said she has a way to beat the grid, so I'm inclined to believe her. Anyway, her name is Jen. Go talk to her. And Jen. I'll get back to work on figure. Okay. Nice. The other's reputation is increased. And what's it at now? Okay, now we're neutral. Ah. You got a lot of materials from that last one. I take it you talked to Paige. Yep. I did and I do, yep. But there's something we need to take care of. What's that? So, okay. Hilariously, I'm looking for something that is designed to be invisible. Untraceable. It's so a suit stealth that hides boy. you from everything, even laser detection grids. Which would help out with all 79, right? Absolutely. Uh, yeah. How do we find something that's designed to not be found? Nothing is completely untraceable. Think of it like a swimmer that's underwater. It might take a while, but they have to pop up for air, right? So there's always brief moments of exposure, even if it's only exposed to certain eyes. You get what I'm saying? And so who's watching for Just your swimmer? For watching, but there's one that would have been designed to see it probably also relay that sighting too but just sending that update could blow your cover if you did it directly kind of defeats the purpose right are yes. you just agreeing out of anxiety okay we need to go take out a liberator bot to see if it has a record of another piece of chinese tech all right okay. i'll see if we have anyone around here who can help out with the next part uh, you should ask Dr. Penelope Hornray. I recognize that name. Is she good with robots? I can do it. Yeah, she's very good with Excellent. robots. Thank you for the heads up. I... They said you were one of the best scavengers. How long oh, have you been doing it? Well, my parents both used to take me along when they went. So I guess I've been doing this most of my life. Okay, I thought she was going to give me some Safe good information. There. All right, so we need to find Kill a Liberator and collect its body. Can add chicken to the menu. Um. It should give us, uh, okay. We can just go straight to Vault 76. All right, I'll take that. Might as well. Vault 76 was built to save the best and brightest in the event of a nuclear holocaust. On Reclamation Day, they would emerge and begin the rebuild and begin to rebuild America. At least that's what they were supposed to. You thought. When you're building at workshop, a camp, you can scrap objects to remove them from the world. Doing so will grant half the components used to build each object. Here's one of the uh, screenshots I took on back, like, in release. Oh, nice. We got a, a new plan. It's something else there, too. Uh, let me go to the notes. Picnic table, that, that. Okay, so we need to kill a liberator. So there's probably one around here. We're very close at least. There's the starting people. Starting NPCs that you talk to. Okay, liberator, liberator, where art thou liberator? Swap weapons to one that. Nice. Go. There's usually one on this path. It's usually like right there. Aha! <laughs> Collect the body. All right, return with the liberator. Oops. What? It's not free this time. 
All right, I'll fast travel to my camp and then travel there then. 37 caps to travel to the foundation. Boy. My dog just stretched and she looks like she's about to fall off the bed now. Cops protection robots were meant to replace human workers in areas they were deemed dangerous. Yay. Alright, now. Let me actually check. Yeah. I still have about 100 pounds of weight that I can carry additional, so. We can just travel here. Yeah, it, li it literally halved the amount of caps it would have taken to fast travel there, so. I would say traveling to my camp was well worth it. For the Great War, Appalachian Mining Companies and other industrial interests pursued automation to a near unprecedented degree leading to widespread job loss and civil unrest plus of weapons deal damage in wide area wide area of effect uh they include grenades mines the fat man and the missile launcher nice here we are kind of wish Hello, you could what uh <laughs> He didn't have any of his gear on for a second there. I wish you could just like fast travel to inside, but guess not. And that's that's all right. Okay, Founders Hall. Egg leads the raiders at Crater with a cool head and pragmatic pragmatic nature but she won't hesitate to employ violence if she or her people are threatened okay finally got your uh, liberator oh, the, the kitty Fruity fruity. Ah, hello again. <laughs> Put that robot on my workbench, will you? Yeah, 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 yeah. Face liberator. I'll be honest. I was hoping you'd have the mother load just hanging around your room. Oh no, there's no room for that. No, no. Oh shoot, dehydrated. Try to make an appearance. <laughs> so, do you want the logs from this robot? Yep. Look for an entry that begins with 58 when you're in. That should list any entries related to our target. These logs look encoded, but like nothing I've seen before. I see the numerical headers you mentioned, though. The entry you're looking for would have been broadcast daily since about 11 years ago. Just read the stuff in brackets at the end when you find it. Purified water. The part in the brackets says nice. BAI2. What is that? UAN2. YUAN2. And then the number 7. I'm afraid that's all Chinese to me. As in, it's actually Chinese. To everyone. So. White Spring? Uh, oh! White Spring! Yeah. Why seven, though? Hmm. Oh. Seventh hole on the golf course, maybe. What? Wait, you don't. Do you? What, speak Chinese? I mean, it's been a while, but yeah. Wait, so my mom's last known location was a golf course? I don't get it. Sure. I can't imagine there's anything spy worthy there. What the heck would she be doing there? Are you saying what I think you're saying? <sighs> yes, they were spies. My parents were spies. They're both dead, all right? I was born here. I don't know about any of that. No, 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 I don't care about. I mean, you're looking for spy gadgets? That's like a dream project. <laughs> Can I see everything when you get back? Uh, 
sure? That'd be great. Okay, so what's the plan? It had this biometric encoding, and I think it'll work for a close relative like me. But um, let, let, let's talk later. You said you're recalibrating the robot. To do what exactly? Where'd the robot go? To find the tech if it's still nearby, and not shoot at anyone along the way. Maybe if you take it to the seventh hole, it'll pick up the signal again. I'll get the lab ready for when you get back. Be safe out there, you two. She's coming with. Hey, what's the plan, Jen? Wow, I feel like we're actually finally going to find it after talking to Penny. I've never been this close. So, you ready to go? Yep. Really? All right. But before I go, I should probably talk to Paige. I can catch up with you later. All right, I'll head to Wet Spring. I can't believe that Penny's cat isn't robotic. What a letdown. <laughs> Booty fruity. <laughs> Wait, what the? Uh, you're a ghoul. Hey. You're a ghoul too. You're a human. Uh, wait, there's a hollow tape. Oh, this is Paige's room? I guess. Go to the seventh hole. All right. Yeah, we'll take the 10 caps to get there. I think after uh, after this one, I'm gonna take a quick break, but I'm just gonna wait a little bit until we go do that. Inside of specific PvP events, players do reduce damage to each other until both sides have attacked each other. <laughs> It used to be so bad if you put on, if you don't put on pacifist mode and you start shooting at the same route as a friend. So much damage to each other. Nice, the golf club. This place always reminds me of like the white glove society. One day I'll return to New Vegas. I promise, one day. be cool if you could like hop into one of these and drive it around Go, Liberator, go! <laughs> ah! Okay, go, go, go! I'm going down. <laughs> the deep. What's going on down here, eh? Oh no, he broke.
Move. Ah! Level 30! Oh no, really? That would break on me. Right when I need it most. Oh my gosh. I barely have like any weapons left to use. No ammo. Who's that? Communist soldier? Ow. No, no. Ah, shoot. all my armor breaking right now no worries oh and a level 54 liberator jesus Oh, right. I'm level 40. Oh, crap. I have a ton of equipment that I can take over at uh, my base. Forgot about that. So I can use this now. One just fell. Whoa, that's crazy. How is that fair? I'm getting rocket shot at me right now. Like, are you kidding? Bro, what? Bro, I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. What the fuck? What the hell, man? There's like no, there's literally no type of like level, like equalization in this. Like there's literally level 30s to level 50s spawning in this tiny little area. That's the one thing that does frustrate me is there's no level scaling. There's nothing that's like, oh, recommended you should be this level because i just fought three like level 50s and two level 20 or 30s yet here i am level 40 like bruh please give us some sort of like here's your recommended level for this mission or some sort of i don't know anything really Okay, now I need to find my body because I lost all my equipment. Here it is. Oh, really? You're gonna flank me? Oh, oh, you're just gonna come out with- Oh my god. 
All right, running, running, running. Okay. It's gonna flank me and come out with their power armor all of a sudden. Don't. Whoa. I don't want to fight. I don't want any trouble. I'm here again. You don't look like a prisoner in that yes, spy suit. I can see why that would be confusing. Not all of us have the luxury of choice. They threatened to kill my family. From what I have overheard on these listening devices, you are working with my daughter. I knew it. She's on her way here, right now. I didn't want her to have to witness the inevitable. But here we are. This ends the same either way. She shouldn't be long now. They... Hey, there you are. I'm here. How I did she... Mom, how did she make it through that entire you thing? You had no armor, completely unscathed. Die, like, what? Why are you here? What is this place? Jen. Why would you come here, you foolish child? You need to leave. We came here looking for your corpse. I needed a suit, but I buried dad with his years ago. I couldn't get it off. He was killed in it. I didn't know you were alive down here. How could I? You left. Just don't move, okay? I, I'm trying to think of a way where you walk out of this. Where we don't just kill you along with everyone else down here. Uh, what's the plan? This is... I can't believe what... Just need a spy tech. The rest of it doesn't matter. You're right. She abandoned me. Let, let's just get the suit and go. If she really just wants to be alone, then that's her choice. If I give you this suit, then they'll come for you. And they'll find me. Maybe not tomorrow. I don't care if I die. I may as well already be dead. While the outcome might seem the same, avoiding death now means you at least have a chance to avoid death in the future. That's right! I get that it's hard not to assume things are hopeless, but you've been trained. I can help you. So, how does this work? How can we save you? I'll have to go into hiding and destroy the suit. We might be able to shield the signal from the suit once or twice. But are you willing? I don't really need it after getting it Vault 79. Without having seen the track, uh, this device, I can't be sure, but it might be possible for Penny or I to crack the countermeasures. But you need Intelligence 12. Eh, I we'll say that. Right. I'll finish up here and then meet you back at Foundation, okay? Thank I you need a moment. for sparing my life. Of course. Alright, I am uh, fast traveling out of this hellhole because... No. Meet Jen in Foundation. Yeah, gladly. It just bothers me that there's no, like... There's no, like, standard level for things, so there's no scaling. I think this game would do a lot better if there was, like, level scaling or something of that sort. Because, I mean, once you hit level 100 anyways, like, you're just one-shotting everything at that point. So, what's the even point? Like, you can, you can just make the game scale to your level, and then you're fine. Or give players the option. There should be like a, in your game, like it's personalized to you. So if you put on scaling, okay, all the enemies scale to your level. And then if you turn it off, then okay, now you have leveled areas. I feel like it would make it a lot better. Especially since you can't walk around without any uh, companions or anything. If you're by yourself, man, when it gets, gets tough. 
Especially if you're 10 levels under. Under an enemy that you're fighting. Don't mind that. Okay, I walked in there. I saw two liberators level 30. I'm like, oh, okay. This is going to be. So it's like around my level. Oh, no. But then there's like 10 level 50 communist soldiers that come out absolutely out of nowhere. And just start attacking you like crazy. But that place was really cool, but it still bothers me. That portion bothers me at least. All my equipment's broken right now. Hey, I got the suit. All right, I'll see you then. Around then. Sounds good. Nice. So I saw Jen and Penny are working on that stealth tech. The blueprints don't exactly list the spec sheet, but there's a lot of install ports and wide open space. Penny, I had to reach out to some specialists who've been shadowing us since the pit they've agreed to meet but all right just so you know these people are uh rigid when it comes to... i'm gonna mark a spot on your map go th that'll let them know you're the one they keep their distance but they've always helped us out when okay Uh, let me go to raise the flag at the designated spot. Let's actually wait for this quest completion thing to finish. Ooh. Duty calls. All right, all right, all right. Okay, let's scrap some items real quick. Good at weapons. Any special ones we got? Nope. Okay, I uh, I'm gonna repair some then if I can. Oh wait, this is the uh, rafting area. My life has changed so much, so quick. Actually, before we do that, let's check the stuff that I have over here. So weapons, first thing, go to this and I'm going to disintegrate that or actually no, I'm going to hold on to this so that way I can trade it in at that special dude. Black diamond. Huh. Okay. Level 40. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, baby. 
Oh my god. <laughs> oh yes. Junkies. That's level 25. I'll take this and just hold it on. To, hold it on to it. 45. Take it. That's level 45. Brenities. That's broken. Now, armor. Let's see what we got here. Yep, there's a level 40 item. So, left leg. I know some of my... This gives me a uh, minus 15 damage from robots. Eh. And that's broken as well. Okay. 5% accuracy with guns, yeah. I hear him playing, I think that's the bass. <laughs> Right leg, we'll take it. Level 40 right here. Nice digs around here. Right leg, we can stay. 45. Okay, now, what I'm gonna do here is I'm just gonna straight up. Can I unfavorite all my equipment? Wait, what was that? Survival tent? Okay, so now that all that is clear, let's see, let's start by damage, yeah, that's fine. Okay, so that's all, of, or actually, search by, wait, there's usually one that lets you see, not the damage, but the rounds, rate of fire. Cause I want to look at it by like ammo. Okay, so this is level forty. Yeah, I'll probably keep that. Uh, so five five six is covered. Yeah. This one does more damage though. And it has better fire rate and everything else, but this one lasts longer. Level 40, this is a 45 weapon. Yep, I'll keep that. Oh, wait. Yeah, 45 ammo. Uh, this shotgun is good, but I need the, uh, I need to make some shotgun shells. This, yeah, we'll keep it. 308, okay, so. I'm gonna try to repair, try to repair this guy. Is this one, I, they're both literally the same. 45 pipe rifle. Uh, I have this other rifle that's a lot better. Pumpkin grenade. Sniper rifle, this is just plasma. Recon, it's 44. Yeah, I'll take that. Cell. The shotgun, I don't think I'm gonna use it anymore. 
Let me equip this. We'll compare these two shotguns. So this one actually has better damage. Damage increased after each consecutive hit on the same target. Oh my god. And never mind that other shotgun. <laughs> Submachine gun. This is a 45. And Tesla rifle. That one's level 40. So if I look at the Tesla rifle versus the salvaged salt. Charge by reloading repeatedly. The more charges, higher the damage. Radiates user. Okay. So I'm actually going to transfer that back then. So. We'll keep that. So that way we have one. Same thing with that. The Saltron can go away. Submachine gun. I like that gun, so I'm going to put it back in there. Wait, do I have anything? I don't think I have anything that takes 10 millimeter rounds. Okay, so that's all set. And yeah, that looks pretty good too. Now, armor. So right arm, if we cannot remove it, I would prefer not to remove it. Left leg, uh, the left leg, right leg. Much better. The urban scout armor is a lot better. Gain up to plus three when low health. Okay, left leg. There. Oh wait, that's broken. Chest piece. It's a lot better. Actually, I'm gonna hold on to this chest piece until it's broken and then I'll put on the last bastion. Actually, no, vice versa. This left leg is a lot better. Okay. Let's scare, uh, scrap some stuff here. So this guy, that can go away. That can go away. Bye. And hold on to these two. Now peril, that chest piece I'm gonna hold on to. Right leg. I have another right leg on, right? Yep, I do. Left leg. Arm. Wrapper chest piece. That I was gonna get better stuff from breaking that thing down, but apparently not. He's jamming out there. <laughs> okay. Weapons. I'll favorite what I have left here. This guy, this guy, and that guy. Alright, and. Now perks real quick. I know Kiara, we'll take a break in a second here. First aid. It's a good. Okay. Just wanna look at the armor. Oof. Can I fix this? Really? Ballistic fiber. It's always ballistic fiber. <sighs> ballistic fiber.
And I just take this off. Oh my god. I just untagged all my stuff for search. Really? I just untagged so many things for search. I know, if I'm in your I way. know Kiara. One sec. I, uh, I wish I could have reached Weapons. More. Why? Why? Why is everything so hard to repair? My weapons, they can be repaired, no problem. It's them. F damn. Other stuff. It takes forever. Is this shotgun broken? Oh, no ammo, that's why. Okay, let me craft some shell ammo then. I know. Go in a second, Kiara. Hold. Okay. Can I make shells? Shotgun shell. Here we are. Nice. <laughs> She's stretching. All right, um, I'm gonna take a quick break here and then I will be right back in a few minutes. Um, I'm just gonna have a quick snack and better eat, so BRB. All right, I'm back and we're getting back into a game here. Okay, so, um, hey, by the way, uh, Jason and uh, Polaris, thank you for the follow. Appreciate it, guys. <coughs> What's going on, RU Sampler? Resampler? Camp could not be placed. Would you like to move? Try to find another world. I think someone was in my spot. <laughs> world found. On October 23rd, 2077, in what came to be known as the Great War, the world was engulfed in nuclear fire, and the United States, a fortunate minority, escaped to the safety of great unround vaults. Underground vaults. Ah. <sighs> Time flies playing this game. I I feel like it flies or goes a lot faster than like literally any other what? game I've played recently. What, miss? You want orc? Where am I at? What? 
Oh, put me all the way down here. I was like, wait a minute, isn't my house usually right here? Whoa. I got some chips and I like crumple them up and put them inside of her. Like she has a hollow bone that was originally filled with peanut butter. Um, but I put them inside there and uh, kept her busy for a little bit until it looks like now. Mr. Pebbles, the first cat in space. <laughs> What are you looking for? Huh? <coughs> Ladies and gentlemen, we are one away from 800. Wild. I literally feel like I just hit 700. Which I kind of did like a month and a half ago. Okay. Okay. Do I? Am I wearing a piece of armor that's like just completely broken? Yeah, my left arm. Okay. Maybe I can make some. Yeah. Why? Why you arf arf? Sentry bot helmet. Sturdy armor. Let's uh, raise the flag at the designated area. Where's that at? Actually, let's check our stats too. Oh, we can take both of those to them. I'll get the well rested and then uh, we'll take well tuned bonus too. A minute ago when I went to go get a snack, a snack, um, I looked up. So apparently most people still say that crafting armor is better than repairing it. And same thing with crafting new weapons. Um, only thing with that is it costs so much to make them half the time. But, um, yeah, I don't know. I can go back and forth on that but it is very hard to find a lot of the materials to repair them so i can understand why it might be better to uh do the other one banjo the banjo is invisible oh there it is Nice. All right, we're well tuned. So now we can go do that. Well rested, well tuned, well fed. Look at that. Uh, let's go to oh yeah, data. Duty calls, show on map. All right, well, I don't, we don't really have much other choice. I'm gonna wait until I have like a thousand caps someday to before I start going to other places and looking at their uh, 
equipment and workshops and stuff. Or after I finish the story, I can do that too. Um, might see if Soldier Pat's on. Doesn't look like it. But I'll ask him. I right, good. Resolution still looks good. Yeah, I'm, I don't have any friends playing. American flag. Vault dweller, we see your signal. Make your way due north towards the hill. You'll see a concrete bunker. We will be watching your approach carefully. It's like the military. Or pipe rifle? Sure. Oh god, get inside, get inside. Ah! Most cases, quest progress in private interiors. It's only saved for once all the activity is completed. And I didn't get to read the rest. Talk to the specialist. Knock, knock. Unstoppable's boy game. Gordian. <gasps> Doggo. Private Lucky. Sergeant Thompson. Sergeant Radcliffe. Captain Fields. Walter Fields. Captain, United States Army. Now that we've got the pleasantries out of the way, I have one question for you. Why the hell are you planning on stealing America's gold reserve? Uncle Sam not give you enough hugs and kisses while he was keeping you safe in that vault? <laughs> you want to use that gold for a new currency, create a real economy. World ends, suddenly every Tom, Dick, and Mary thinks they're in charge. What makes you so special, huh? I used to hostile me. 